And we're back in Game of Thrones. Or two Game of this Thrones. Way. I can't talk already. This is a great start. I love King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. You used to love this place. Remember, we'd come listen to the What did you want to talk about? Lady Marjorie. What did you want to talk about? Just through here. Is there something yes, in your do. brain going on up there? You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest wine. I want no part of this. You're going to get us both in trouble. Relax. Nobody will miss it, I assure you. I'm not drinking this. A little won't hurt. Suit yourself then. So, are you lesbian? Right. We're much better animated than they are. Well, I just. What? Come on! Just say it. I'm not very good at this sort of thing. I know it, she's a lesbian. Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. Then don't tell you me. You can tell no one. I want to trust you. Sarah, just tell me. Right. Fine. Just please, keep it a secret. Not if Marjorie tells me, asks me. My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. Oh, the shame on her she family. Became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. Ah. You're a bastard? Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am. I know that. So... But to always have to hide. What of your father? Who is he? I don't know. My mother died not long after my birth. Okay. Who else knows about this? Lady Marjorie. Okay, good. Her grandmother. Marjorie would be the only person I'd and tell And now you. To. It's just... I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. I need Lady Marjorie to arrange a marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. Who do you want to marry? Do you have someone in mind? Someone you'd wish to marry? I'd have to convince Lady Marjorie to make an introduction first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe. Well, as long as it doesn't interfere with my plans. You wanting to talk, you might suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you, it's sure to mean a lot. And what would I stand to gain if I did this? Seven hells, Mira. Do you ever think about anyone besides yourself? Do you? I came to you for help. No, you're right. I'm sorry. That sorry. came out wrong. No, I'm sorry. I know your family's troubles are much greater than mine. Indeed, very much. What happened to your brother and your father? You sure you won't have any? 100% sure. You look like you could use a drink. 100% sure. Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaidens. Lord Tyrion. My lord. Ladies? My wine senses are tingling. What have we here? If you mean to drink from that flagon, you're going about it the wrong way. We're just enjoying the sunshine. Is that what they're calling wine these days? I should have picked silence. Not the finest arbor red, but a favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Go ahead Since and I'm tell certain me. my sister didn't give it to you, she won't even share with me. Though that's hardly surprising. Sarah took the wine from the cellars. You? I, uh... It's always the quiet ones. 
I suggest bringing cups next. I promise to keep the bastardry a secret. You'll drink wine stolen from the Queen Regent, but you won't risk an alliance with me. I did not drink the you wine. You need to know what risks are worth taking. Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. Oh my! Most of the Royal Navy lit up in green flames. It must be rebuilt. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet representatives of Lord Whitehill. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the Ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man, but judging by his up-jumped sellswords, negotiating with him won't be pleasant. You can't trust Lord Whitehill. I don't intend to. That's right, Tyrion never trusts anyone. Come with me. Sure. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. Imagine their surprise when I bring a forester to the table. Mm, okay. It might be the first fun I've had in months. My lady? I'm game. I'm next to Tyrion. I have plot immunity as long as I'm not a Lannister myself. <laughs> she keeps the wine. We've been waiting here for an hour. Andros, be courteous. Courtesy in a merchant. Like finding gold in your chamber pot. Apologies, my lady. Who is this? Some girl you've brought for entertainment. My name is Mira Forrester. Oh, shit. Mira Forrester? Why are you here? A fair question. We were told we would be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. Perhaps you should ask Lord Tyrion. I asked you. Andros. She's here for the same reason you are. Ironwood. I'm sorry, Lady Mira, but we've already spoken to Lord you Tyrion. You spoke, I listened. Lady Mira has since persuaded me to consider her offer first. Now, if you'll excuse us. You're going to dismiss? You can't us? do this. I assure you, I can. This is a mistake, my lord. I don't think so. Dude, Tyrion's immortal. Lord White <laughs> will hear of this. Sure. He's not a man to take such matters lightly. There's no need to make threats. You have no idea. Lord Tyrion. Lord Tyrion, do let me know when you've come to a decision. I'd like the opportunity to change your mind. Lady Mira. Good day, gentlemen. That did not go as well as I would have thought it would, but ah, well, we're alive, so... That was fun. Now, as for your offer, what did you have in mind? My lord? The Crown's Iron Room. I assume you have a proposition? Yes, um, we will sell everything to the you Crown. had a reason for coming here. I know it wasn't just to entertain me. Help me stop the White Hills. Well, the quickest way to strangle your enemy is with his own purse strings. Say the Crown agrees to buy Ironwood solely from you. Lord Whitehill will be left in the cold. If he wishes to sell to the Crown, he'll have to do so through your family. You will have him at your mercy. Or you'll bring your houses to open war. You do know that's a possibility, don't you? Then that's a risk I'll have to take. I'll consider the arrangement. Hmm. Of course, you'd have to do something for me in return. I'll do anything for Tyrion. Don't worry. The terms will be fair. Whatever it is, I'll do it. I just asked you for an open favor, and you agreed as if I were inviting you to tea. You're either very brave or very foolish. It's definitely both. We have an understanding, then. Thank you, my lord. This will either be very good for both of us, or very bad for you. For your sake, I hope it's the former. 
my lady. Oh, goody, an Asher section. It looks like we're gonna stab people this time. So this is gonna be a fun one. I always like the stabby missions more than the talky missions. I usually fail at them, but whatever. Heck, maybe we'll even get to see Danny. Daenerys, Stormborn. But I'm not gonna say all those titles. Hopefully the game does for me. They were headed for the main gate. I know another way. You come in with us then. If you're to save your house, you'll need more than the two of us at your side. You'll need an army. That's why you're here, isn't it? To hire one. An army of cell sorts. And a man to lead them. Do you hear what I'm saying, boy? I can lead an army. I know you can. I've always known it. Your father was blind to that. None of that matters without sellswords to hire. And all the companies around here are engaged. Are we buying Unsullied? What about Croft? One-eyed Croft, with the second sons. They're all with the Targaryen girl now. But Croft owes me a favor. I'm pretty sure he hates you, actually. No. He'll help us. I'll make sure of it. And how are you going to do that? We didn't part on the best of terms. I'll be charming. <laughs> right. Right. Okay, let's see it. Okay, they're all closing the doors, so something's about to go down. Or maybe they're well, just eyeing my partner. This mother here. of dragons and her cell swords are headed north, so we make for Marine. Wait, Marine? Shit. What? <laughs> she just went down the list of all the cities she can't be in anymore. Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't afford any distractions. It's not your problem. It'll be fine. I promise. What kind of unfinished business? The kind I'd rather keep to myself. Okay, then. Ponte Renas! We are leaving Yonkai. You have no say in this. There's only like six of you and there's three of us. We're adding people to our numbers rather than losing. And you guys are the ones who are losing your numbers. Stay still. They're over here! Just one more we'll have to kill later. Let's go. You did well back there, Asher. You acted like a true leader. Hiding you so two can valiantly about, about it. Later. We need to get out of here. They won't stop looking for us. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. I hope you're ready, Asher. It won't be easy. Oh, I'm ready to walk. Let's just get that army. I'm ready. Good lad. And we're walking. Either we cross the narrow sea with an army at our backs, or House Forrester will not survive to see winter. I'm seeing a lot of interesting parallels. Like, like we're over in Daenerys land and <laughs> Marine, and we're trying to get an army. We're in Queen's Landing talking about marriage and talking, you know, about political stuff, hanging out with Tyrion. We're in the north and we're, our leaders are dropping like flies and we face war and stuff like that. Well, this is gonna end bad, so... Is that my room? Can I avoid going into this place? This is going to get me caught up in stuff. I'm already caught up in enough stuff as it is. Don't look! Don't... Just... 
Well, just open the door like it's normal. It's the coal boy. You've been sorting through my mail, but I have nothing to hide, so... Um, that's at the chest. Can we make sure there are no intruders first? Everything's still here. Okay. The letters from my family. What would someone want with them? Hmm. Oh, a book. Let's look at the book first. Was someone going through my books? Well, someone's been looking through my information. Ooh! Was there a body? Why would someone do this? the coal boy calling it he's working for someone or I don't know hmm I have information that will aid you with the imp meet me in the gardens at midnight I doubt I'll go there I've been I'm busy I got other stuff to do it's gonna take me there anyway isn't it <laughs> 